Hey guys, Run with Craft Scissors here with another plan with me. So this one is my personal planner. I plan in this planner on Tuesday nights and it goes up on Wednesday mornings. Um, hopefully I can keep up with the school year starting and everything. Um, you'll probably see less videos of like the twice a day thing that I've been doing lately. Um, hopefully. Because <laughs> it's a lot. So um, this is leftovers from a Label with Love Co. kit that we're going to be using. It's called Enjoy the Little Things and it's supposed to be like a mojito um, kind of feel. Like a lime drink kind of thing. Um, we talked a lot about what this chunk was um, of brown stuff. I think we all decided it was brown sugar. So that was kind of funny in that video. Um, I did pick out two skinny washies that I thought went perfect with this kit. So this is like the lime green and white and then this is the light blue and white. Um, and I thought it went perfect. This was actually from a set of four. There was a pink one that went with it and a gray one. And I think I found them on Ally Express. So if you want to check that out. But I don't have like links and stuff. And then when you don't have a clip to match, the best thing to do is to go with a solid. So I went with a gold bow, and this is in my shop as well. There's also a glitter gold bow, and then there's a foil gold bow. So there's like two different ones. There's a whole bow section. Actually, I've redone the sections in my Etsy shop. So there's like bows, flowers, animals, food, which includes like beverages, like coffee cups and stuff, and like the lemonade that I have. So um, it's a little bit more well organized. There's a tassel section and all that stuff. So it's not just all clumped together as planner clips. So and there's a whole section on succulents. Anyway, so I wanted to show you that. And then um, this is the new freebie for a while. I stocked up on this ribbon because it's so cute. Those are little maple leaves. So these are the new freebies that'll go in every order. Um, so if, I think what I'm gonna do though, cause if you shop the sale um, for the planning posse sale, you get the, um, the what's I'm gonna call it? Where'd it go? The acorn, you get the acorn. There it is. So if you shop the sale and you um, use, you do the whole spend $15 and get 30% off, you get this little acorn on Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Um, but if you're one of those people where you're like, I'm not spending $15, um, use my YouTube code and you still get this one. I think I will do a way to get both of these. It'll probably be like spend $15 after coupon. So like not just spend $15, get 30% off, so you're only spending 11, like spend $15 after coupon and then you can get both or something like that. Um, so I'm hoping to do that because I know a lot of people do that. They're like, this is the freebie for everybody, but if you spend more, then you can get this one as well. So I think that's how I'm gonna basically give away both. So if you spend less than 15 and don't use the like planning posse code, then you do get this. But if you spend over and you use the planning posse code, you get this. But if you spend over $15, you can get both. That sounds really confusing. I need to work on that. Um, and then I also restocked. This is not a new release. This is a restock. Um, it used to have a little hot pink circle for the cheek. I got rid of it. I think it looks really cute without it. Um, I felt like it was very distracting and it was kind of bulky. Um, so I hope you guys like the new giraffe. Plus, I thought it would go with a lot of safari kits that are out there. I'm going to be doing a safari kit soon from Britannia Nicole, so be watching for that. So this was a restock this week. And then I also did this one, which was technically a new release this week, but it was for the Plan With Me design group. So this one's crooked, so it's mine. I didn't realize that. <laughs> I thought it was one of those where all the petals were the same and I could just throw it together. You can't. I have to perfectly match it up, so pain in the butt. Um... <laughs> <laughs> but it's really cute and you can get this in my shop. It's with the Play With Me Design Group collab. They're doing a peekaboo planning um, kit and it's like a glamping kit. So you have to join the Play With Me Design Group to get that kit. Um, but this one is in my shop to kind of go with it. You can get it without the rhinestone or with the rhinestone um, because some people just don't like glam. But I figured it kind of goes with the glamping thing, the theme. Um, and this flower actually matches one of the flowers in the kit. So I want to talk about that because I know some of my Play With Me Design Group girls watch this video. All right, sorry for the long intro. All right, and as always, my um, Paper Mate gel pin. All right, let's get started. Okay, so these are washies and then like huge checklists and habit trackers. We've got little label things I can throw in like if we go out to eat with people. This will probably be something I add throughout the week. Um, I'm definitely gonna start with my date covers and I use these to go with it. Um, so I'll show you how I do that. And then I have one full box checklist 
um, which I'm probably going to use down here. And then I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I have enough half boxes to go in every box. And I have a bunch of checklists, full of checklists and half checklists. So we'll be adding those as we go too because that will be fun to try to use up the kit. And then as far as the deco goes, I have these cute little flags. And then I also have some deco left here that I specifically left because I wanted to be able to plant it again. And then there's some cute little like um, functional deco as well. I'm not sure what the air, the paper airplane is for. Is it for like airplane flights or like sending mail? What do you think? I don't know. Maybe Jenna will come on here and tell us. She has her own channel too, Label with Love Code does. So make sure you check out her. I usually link her channel with her, with my discount code. She has her own Etsy shop now, or not Etsy shop. She has her own website now. There we go. So let's use the washi. This is not thin at all. So I'm excited about that. I think we're gonna make flags. Let's do that. So I looked at like the washies and I was like, I don't remember what I used when I did this kit the first time, but at the same time, she has washi that comes with her kits that fit it. So I think I used all of that up the first time I planned in this one with this one. This one is way more like paper, this washi tape. Like you can't even hear it when I peel it kind of thing. So it's kind of interesting. It's a little different. It's good though. I mean, I haven't had any problems with it as of yet. So we're gonna do it that way. And then do another one. Not a flag banner. I don't usually do flag banners. One, they take a long time, and sometimes by the time I'm done with it, I don't like it. <laughs> so then I feel like I just wasted a bunch of time, you know? So I don't really do them anymore. Um, so what have we been up to? Today, I ran a bunch of errands for my shop to get ready for the sale. And um, if you've ever ordered from me before, thank you so much. I just... I love filling orders. I love making stuff for people. Um, and I hope you guys get that when you get my packages and they're stamped with funny stamps on the back that say like, handmade with love, or this is not junk mail. Or like the washi, if you like the washi, it's wrapped around. And I always include a note card and stuff like that. So, um, and then the freebie sampler from Cupcakes and Stickies doesn't hurt either. So, cause I like to send it like it's friend mail more than just like, cause obviously I'm not a corporation. <laughs> it's just me <laughs> nobody else <laughs> hmm. okay I'm gonna do a little bit of a gap oh. an eyelash or something who knows so my nails have been peeling on the sides I, th I swear it's from the chlorine from the pool though I'm gonna make this a little bit shorter um, I'm pretty sure that's what it's from or because I had a different girl use it which I think I mentioned that before or a different girl do my nails. So I have another appointment scheduled on the 12th. I'm going to do that one. But if they peel like this again, I'm not going to keep up with doing this. I might as well just paint my own nails. Because the first one chipped. This one chipped. Like, mm, I'd only had them for like four days. And I think getting a nail fixed cost money. So I didn't want to bother with that. If that makes any sense. And then I tried to fix the ones on the edges right here and right here. I took another hot pink nail polish that I had and tried to fix it. Okay, so how am I going to make that happen? I got like matches where I put that one. Hmm. No, don't move. The whole idea is that this side does not move while I'm doing this. <laughs> and then I try to approximate... Okay, I think that's good. It's good enough. I mean, they're not right next to each other anyway. They're in like a binder, obviously, so it's not that big of a deal. I thought that would be cute. Sticking out from the top. A little extra something something. Okay, I don't know why I shut this one. Alright, so I'm going to go all the way across with this. I really have liked switching to just skinny washi in here. Um, that's been really nice. I used, I tried to even use some wider washi in my plan with me when I did the Planner Society plan with me last time, and it just not did not go well. 
Okay, so we ran a bunch of errands today, and then my son was, like, begging me to go to McDonald's. It was funny, because he thinks, like, every time we run errands, if he's good, he gets McDonald's. So funny. Um, that's not the case, by the way. He just kind of thinks that. <laughs> he's four. <laughs> if you didn't know. If you're new to my channel, welcome. <laughs> I'm a mom and a teacher. <laughs> so, um, we did that. Oh, there's a little mess up. There's a big white line right there. Oh well, the AliExpress, it's cheap. I don't expect perfect. <laughs> that one is that cheap. I think I got like these four rolls for like less than $2. And it's like free shipping on like everything on that website. It's crazy. You never know what's going to get here though because it's from China. Like everything is. <laughs> so if you're like, you know, you don't care when you get it, then it's perfect. Okay. So I'm trying to get things done. I know I need to get my son's haircut this week, but I don't know if it's going to happen. I think I'm going to put it off until Monday, which is like the day before his doctor's appointment. And then that night, I basically start back to work. Um, I know that sounds silly, like to wait till Monday, but you know, it is what it is. And looks so cute. I keep trying to push it up further than it needs to be. I don't know why, because honestly, I'd like to bring it closer to myself while I'm doing this. Okay. Now, I usually end up covering most of this up, but I still like that it comes all the way out to here to match the other one. So I do it anyway. See how quiet this washi tape is? And it's really like paper. Like, it tears like paper. It's crazy. I love it. Okay, enough about my washi. Stop talking about the washi. Um, let's see. Date covers. Oh, we need tweezers. Why are you tweezers? Do I even know where my tweezers are? I don't see them. Usually I have them sitting, hanging out the side of my cup. And they're not there. So odds are they're on somewhere in a mess on my desk. And I'm not going to try to find Oh, nope. Found them. Had y'all going, didn't I? It was, all, it was all just a joke. No, it wasn't. You guys all know. She had no idea where they were. Oh, they're there. It's like, where's the label thingies? Okay, so I'm going to put these down and then put the dates next to it. That's my plan. Okay, I don't need the uh, tweezers for this part. I need the tweezers for the dates. I'm going to cover this up. Just like that. And so basically I'm just going to write the days of the week instead of having them already on there. I know it's not really necessary, but I think it makes it just a little bit cuter. Makes it a little bit more my planner. So like, we're starting with seven. So I'm gonna put the seven over it. See? So that's what it'll look like. Eight. I think it's cute. Just adds a extra little touch and puts these to good use. Oh, the green. Wow. It's like, it's like exactly the same color almost. Yeah, that was pretty good. Pretty good, pretty good. Um, things went really well with shopping with my son, so that made me happy. And then I got some new releases done. I'm hoping to get some more done. Um, so far, I'm not going to say what it is, but I'm going to say I got an animal done, a new tassel done, tassel clip, and I got a new flower clip done. So I've been pretty productive, if I do say so myself, which I do, because I just did. All right, it goes blue and light blue. And I'll add those dates in. See, that was the blue I wasn't sure about. Because see, like, it's like in between this blue and this blue. I don't know. I was trying. And then I was like, you know what? I really like these washies, so I'm just going to use it. <laughs> oh, and I successfully made it out of the craft stores that I needed to get stuff for my shop in um, without buying any washi. Which is actually very impressive for me. Because I like to buy washi. 
Okay, so all of this sheet got used up eventually. First in my first plan with me, and then the rest in this one. So, yay! Okay, I don't want to put this here because I know I'm going to put that for box checklist. So I was thinking of putting this here, but I don't know if that'll look funny. Well, I can't put it all the way to the edge, that's for sure. Well, and then dark green is going to be hard to write on this. Eh, I like it. Yeah, I don't really like it. I'm losing it. I'm losing it. No, I'm just kidding. Some days. <laughs> right? <laughs> okay, nine. Okay, everybody count with me. <laughs> Funny. <laughs> Maybe like Sesame Street or something. Oh man, you can tell my mom. So what am I excited about for this school year? Um, I'm excited that I'm teaching a bunch of sociology classes and then a bunch of kids have signed up because they want to take it or they want to have me as a teacher because that's kind of like what went around. Because as soon as I found out, I told my students because they all ask. And then I did have a couple that were like, okay, I'm going to go down to the counselor and have my schedule changed right now. Because they kind of can right now. It's annoying for the counselors, but they can. They actually had to open up extra sections. They were only going to have two sections of sociology, and they had to open up four, you guys. And each section has like 30 kids in it. But they're all juniors and seniors, so they're all like the good age, is what I call it. Because I have a theory. So freshmen... They don't really understand high school yet or that like grades matter because in middle schools here like you can fail middle school and then just keep on going it's ridiculous um so i hate that uh let's put this one down so when they get to their freshman year and they realize oh you mean i'm gonna have to retake this if i fail it they like don't get it yet um so they're a little rougher bunch sophomores some have started to care um, but others are just not scared of you anymore, if that makes sense. At freshmen, they're still, like, a little bit scared of you because it's like high school is new, who are you, that kind of stuff. So, um, I don't know where I'm going to put those fun hashtags. This stuff doesn't happen in this one because stuff doesn't get canceled. It's a memory planner, but I can throw those down somewhere. Probably not the goals one, but maybe a no spender lazy day or... You got this if I'm having a rough day. I don't know. This is the week before school starts. So I basically start back this night for freshman for f freshman orientation thing. Okay, and then this has stuff that I might use throughout the week. We'll see if I come back to that. Let's go ahead and put down the half boxes. Which I was thinking... I don't know. I was thinking of putting... One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, six. But I cut one of those in half and make it seven. Okay, I was thinking about. Oh, yeah, that one was torn. I have to be careful. Oh, yeah, this one was kind of rough. I remember that. I was like, what is wrong with you? I like, didn't want to come and get off the sheet. Okay, there we go. So it's a little bit torn, but that's okay. I'll just use something to cover it up. Because that's what I do. Okay, so what I was thinking is putting this down here. But now I don't think that it really fits. But I was thinking of doing it. Hmm, I wonder how these fit. Come on. There we go. I was wondering how these fit. Okay, so these do need to go over here. Okay, so this does need to go here. Oop. And we should be good. It's kind of lining it up with the date to cover. See, there's that tiny tear. Can you see it? Probably not. It's kind of white. Um, so I was thinking I would put like a header or something with each one of these. So like today, I don't know. I'm just kind of like winging it. Like I can list the things we did today? I don't know. I'm just trying to come up with something new. So it's not same old, same old. There. What do you think? 
too much in one box or looks awesome keep going <laughs> like I can hear you <laughs> oh yes Colleen I hear you <laughs> she and I joke about how she's like you always seem to hear me <laughs> I'm like sure I do <laughs> Okay, and what else? Uh, so maybe do. I don't want to do another dark green. Maybe do a little heart one, because that could be anything. I can just write down today again if I wanted to. Doesn't matter. Okay, and then I just kind of tried to line it up with where that box started. It seemed to work out pretty well. A whole bunch of it, no big deal. Don't care. <laughs> Gonna do it anyway. Now I realize that heart looks like it's part of my heart checklist maybe, but it's not, we all know. And actually I think this might be a little bit thinner than my other one. Okay, a little bit of a gap on that one, but I don't think it matters. I don't care. You can care if you want to care. All right. Uh, what else do we do today? We went to a Mexican restaurant because it's Tuesday, so it's Taco Tuesday. Plus, I made lasagna last night. Nope, not last night. Was it last night? Yeah, it was last night. I made lasagna yesterday, and we had it for dinner, my son and I, and then my husband um, had it for, we'll just use all the hearts. He had it for dinner when he got home and then we had it for lunch. Maybe if I put my ruler down. I never use my Iron Condor ruler. But I could go like this and then I can butt it up against it. So I might go back and fix those other ones. I don't know yet. Yeah, let's do that. Let's fix these. Yep, pretty removable. But they're not removable stickers, so depends on your paper that you're sticking it on, in my opinion. Okay. One. Let's just go a little bit further over. On that one. But it butts it up against the side of that, and that's what I was going for. I figured out a way to fix it. Use your ruler as a guide. It just kind of hit me. I don't know. What do you guys do? I had before in my Heidi Swap memory planner when I did that one, the boxes were much wider. It was still like a horizontal kind of thing. So what I did was I would put washi down the middle and divide it into two boxes. Actually, it ended up being three boxes, I think, because I had like a box with lines and then like an open box where you could put like pictures or stickers or whatever you want. Sometimes I wish I had gotten more creative in memory planning in those. But I just honestly didn't know what I was doing. And I was still like heavy into scrapbooking. And I still am, but it's not as much. Like I used to scrapbook every day. And now I just, I don't have time to do it like that. Like that intense. Okay, put my ruler down. Yeah, that's much easier. Much, much easier. I think this will be fun. I'll have like, sometimes I just use um, the boxes as like almost like scrapbook paper where I stick stickers on top of it. Um, so it's like a little bit of deco. All right, that box. I don't think I have a weekend banner. I don't think I have one that matches either because the ones I have are like pink and orange. There is a green, but it's more of an olive green. So I don't think I'll use those. 
So we went to Jose Locos and then my son like pretty much demanded ice cream from his grandparents. And so they gave him ice cream so then I get ice cream, which was nice. But then at the same time I'm like trying to do DDP yoga, but I just have not had time. Like I turn around and I'm like, okay, um, there's dishes, there's laundry, there's I need to film, I need to work on my shop, like there's just too much going on. But I was hoping to get to it more this week, but I don't think that's happening. Okay, so I'm going to make a ruler for this one to be against this. Now, if I have to cut some off, I don't care. I want it to be next to it, just like the other one. Yeah, I'll have to cut some off, but that's okay. Don't care. Like I said. I do decorate my school teacher planner. I have looked at, well, okay, I tried to look at the ha teacher happy planner. They're out of stock. So, because I'm like, I know it's seven subjects, but I think I could get away with it if I just save like the last box as like a to-do list or like stuff to get done on my conference period kind of list. Um, I think I could make it work because I technically teach, um, I think five, I teach five classes and then we have like a homeroom where I, there is stuff I have to get done in that one as well, but it's not as intense. Like I'm not lesson planning. It's more like make sure you print off their grade checks and make sure you tell so-and-so they have a makeup test. Like that kind of thing goes in those boxes. And I don't film that one. Um, because I just get it done on like during that during that um, conference kind of study hour is usually when I get stuff done like that. Decorate my planner real quick because the kids can come up and ask me questions, but I'm not really teaching. But it's like can't really work on anything intense or go make copies because I have to stay in my classroom. I hope that makes sense to you guys. A little bit different. I'm a high school teacher, so if you're like, man, mine's not like that, and you're an elementary teacher, that's probably why. But we're also a rotating block schedule, so we're weird. The study hour is only on Tuesdays and Thursdays. So, and they're shorter on Tuesdays because we have like a late start on Tuesdays for the kids. I still have to be there at the normal time, but I get to talk to my coworkers for 45 minutes. Um, usually it's not a staff meeting, sometimes it is. Uh, but most of the time it's just my department, but still. But sometimes my department head is just like, yeah, I just work in your classroom. I'm like, awesome. I need this. I need the time to do this. So does it bug you guys that I wait until like the end to write in the days of the week? <laughs> I never really think about like that. I didn't think about writing the days of the week. Like I know I will. I'm sure there's been times where I've forgotten. <laughs> and you're like, she didn't even write the days in her planner. <laughs> Probably, <laughs> at some point, I've done that. I don't know. So what do you guys use for memory planning? Are you guys excited about the Mambi memory planner that's coming out? I think it's like August 11th that it's gonna come to Michael's. It's like a happy planner that's just for memory keeping. And they're also gonna come out with a happy planner punch. So you can punch paper match it. Why is that all stuck to the side? Grr. Okay. It's coming off, just it didn't want to. Well, you have to. I'm busy. Okay, I'm gonna cut this. Cut the two off the top. And then we'll use this one again. Right there. Yeah. And then we'll cut those little tabs off. I don't really like the Erin Condren ruler. It's floppy, and I don't really use it as a bookmark, because obviously I make clips. So clips are my bookmarks. Okay, cut those off. Oh man, I just grabbed those off of here thinking, no, oh, that's a good idea, get them off. Now they're stuck to me. Cool. <laughs> um, let's see, what else are we talking about? 
know. I need to order my contact still. I haven't done that. I've been putting it off. Not for any particular reason. Just haven't done it. Alright, so let's go ahead and write the days of the week before I add anything else. So I don't forget. Alright, Monday. Tuesday. Wednesday. And then I'm probably going to have to grab a black to write on that one. Thursday, so Friday. Saturday. Sunday. Thursday. Just because my green is pretty much the same color as that. So I don't mind writing that in. Um, I need something over here. Because that's not going to work for me. Nope, nope, nope. Um, I have these big giant flags. So I wonder, I don't want to layer washi. Mm, they're just not long enough. What should I do? There's this washi. What if I put these down? Right next to each other, there's one piece. Right there. Cut those off a little bit. And then add in the flags. Because then they're not the same pattern. Here's the washi. Oh, I need one more piece of washi. Um, just a skinny one. Use this one. I need one more. There. I don't think that one you'll even see enough of it to know what's on it, but. I didn't like the gray peeking out. That's what I was like, mm -mm, that's not work. That's not gonna work. <laughs> okay, let's get this big lime on here. Big lime. So do you guys like lime in anything? My mom prefers lime in her water to lemon. That's also because my dad's allergic to lemon. So that could also contribute to my mother's decision. Okay, I need to cut that extra off. Just a little bit too long. That's because these stickers are made for Erin Condren, obviously, so they're not going to fit perfectly. So I think it's kind of a fun corner. I'm not sure that you guys can even tell that they're flags, but whatever. Um, and then, uh, I was trying to see where else I should put the flags. I was thinking of putting them up here. But if I do that, then you won't see this part. I don't think it matters. I want to put them up here. So I'm going to do it. Yeah, because they cover that date. Here's this line one. I'm going to get it off. There we go. You won't see this one in two a flag anymore, but I think that's okay. Yeah, I still like it. Maybe I should put another one over here. This one looks like different colors and kind of a whitish background. Put it right here and cover the end of this washi. That could be fun. I don't know, just kind of trying to throw them in there. See what I can do with them. Should put this one here. Yeah. Okay. So I added those flags up there. So this one got completely used up. So we're down two sheets now. Um, not going to fit those in there. Not sure how lime heart checklist would go with any other spread. So probably not going to save that too much. Use some of the washi here. Um, I don't use a habit tracker in here. These I could probably use in another planner because they're just blue and green. 
And then this one I said that I might use later. We'll use the butt first coffee. That one's cute. We'll put that on Tuesday because I know it's going to be like super crazy. And then Label of Love Co. is the brand. Okay, so we'll put this down here. Cover up that white little gap. That's cute. Dreams. Hashtag dreams. That's cute. Oh, something stuck to me. There. I got it. You can do it right there. I don't know. And then there's deco on the sheet, and there's another hashtag. Okay, so lazy day. That one is not going to be like any of those days. And then Saturday and Sunday, that's my last weekend before like school starts, so that's probably not going to be lazy. I'll try to make Monday lazy. And then no spend. Um, I don't really have a set date for that. Goals, you got this. I'll do a you got this on Wednesday because that's kind of my first day back. I have training all day, so hopefully I learn something. Um, workout time, that's not necessary. Reading, dog. There's a planner on here. So I plan in this planner on Tuesdays. So I'll stick that over there. There's like an anniversary. That's not happening. Is there a birthday on here? I don't see a birthday. Nope. There's a cup of coffee. That will probably be happening on Wednesday as well. Because I have to go in early. Um, nail polish. I have my nail appointment on that Saturday before school starts. We'll put that there. Um, doctor's visit. My kiddo has his wellness checkup because he's like never sick. And which is good. And that is on Tuesday. And then don't have a movie night scheduled. There's Happy Meal, dishes, date night. Not sure what we decided that meant yet. There's some more deco. I definitely want to put these like bigger lines in the boxes that don't have like anything going on in the lime mood. Here's a mojito. It's got so many limes and like mint on it you can't even hardly tell what it is. <laughs> it's all good. <laughs> and then here's another big lime. Said I was going to fix that with deco and I'm going to just did. Okay, and then let's put this other mojito glass right there. And then there's another mint leaf um, over here. And then there's some more limes. Get out a lime over here. And a lime over here. There's two more. I don't know what to do with them. The other ones, I had a plan. Okay, that one's kind of like a small deco, so we'll put it with that one. And then this one. Where should it go? Over here? Cool. Cool, cool. Um, I'm going to use a little header that says this week. I think, yeah. And put this right here because I write like this week's favorite things on here. So I'll use that. Header. Uh huh. And then that I said we would use throughout the week. I didn't pull out a birthday sticker, I don't think. I'm going to grab one real quick. I was looking at using these, but I don't think I can use them until the week starts, really. 
This was a sampler. Uh, yeah. Not really. And then we can bring this off to work. I we'll use a little tiny spread pick camera from Planning Roses. That happens on Sundays. I don't bother with Thursday because it's like three more days and it's over. I might as well just wait. And then she already had a planner sticker. So that's in there. So I don't need those. And then this one, the cute little unicorn. Oh, I grabbed that one for some reason. I'm going to take this one. So she's looking up. There you go. So I think that's going to be it for this week. You guys can see what my little, I don't know what my goal is. Learn something, I guess, because I'm supposed to be training. <laughs> that's not really a goal for like my memory planner. <laughs> So there you go. That's what this week is going to look like. I can't wait till it's all filled in and I can show you guys. Um, so thanks for watching. Give it a like and please subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. And I forgot I was going to put a birthday sticker. Hold on. I'm sure I have a birthday sticker somewhere. Birthday, birthday, birthday. Let's look, shall we? Not seeing anything yet. Are you seeing anything? There's a birthday. That's a big birthday. There might be smaller birthdays behind it. That's from Peekaboo Planning. This is a Once More with Love Oopsie. It's really big. Pink Lemonade Designs. It's really girly. Butterfly Planner and Planner Love SP. Mm, it's kind of girly. All of these are kind of girly. I feel like which one matches the kit. I feel like this one does. Down here. And there will probably be cake. I know it's like a full on quarter box, but I don't know. It's not gonna fit. Is the problem. I'll have to cut it off. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. And punch a hole through it. Cool. <laughs> so that one was from Once More With Love because it fit and matched my planner, like the green. Honestly, I'm like, I remember all my green spreads from St. Patrick's Day. Get like a flashback <laughs> to green for weeks. <laughs> all right, so I hope you guys like this. Give it a like and please subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.